Well, we have been talking a lot about Valentine's Day. I wonder why. Right? <laughs> well, if you're still looking for a gift, a lot of the really good ones, they've already been bought and are out of stock. Yes, but if you're still struggling to find a gift for your special someone, or maybe you're not so special <laughs> someone, we have just a thing. <laughs> it's not a brand new idea, but Scoville Zoo is making it its own thing this year, and it's something you just have to see to understand. These are Madagascar hissing cockroaches, and, and this one here that I've been moving hisses a little bit. These are different from the regular house cockroach that you might find. You may step on those, the house cockroach. These, they actually do a good service for the people, and, um, and us too. You know, like in Illinois, we have wood cockroaches out in the, in the forest, in the wild, and they're actually helping break down um, tree fibers and stuff, making compost, you know, for the other thing, organisms to live and grow on and eat. So they actually have a, a very good uh, job out in the wild, and 95% of those cockroaches are doing those jobs out there, and, not, and, and then the 5% that are in your kitchen, yeah, yeah, step on them, yeah, get rid of them. So it's, they're kind of interesting little critters in their own right. So they're not really naked, they're not really moles, they're not really rats, but they do have some hairs around their mouth, the rest of the body is pretty naked, and the hairs actually come in handy, uh, feeling their ways along in the tunnels and keeping dirt and stuff out of their mouth and eyes areas. Um, and they spend most of their lives underground, so they're just eating uh, tubers or the little uh, vegetable things that kind of hang under the ground, and they're in Africa, and the colonies of the naked mole rats will cover a, like a whole football field just with the tunnels and the chambers that they have underneath, and some chambers are just for going to the bathroom, some chambers are for eating, some chambers are for sleeping, some chambers are chambers just for resting, you know, so they just have all these different chambers that they like to go and hang out, and they're very active. To let people adopt our naked mole rat or our um, hissing cockroaches, and um, it's just a, a fun little promotion on Valentine's Day. For the person that has everything, they can have a, a, an, a cockroach or a naked mole rat adopted in their honor. And maybe you have a friend that, or used to be a boyfriend or something that you think of as a cockroach now, a perfect adoption present in honor of them as well. Well, actually, we have animal adoption for a lot of the animals throughout the year, and it seems like these guys don't get as much love as the other animals, like the, the penguins and the cheetahs and the camels and the wolves. You know, they, they all get a lot of good love throughout the year with the different adoptions, but um, sometimes it's just nice to honor the, the, the humble cockroach and the humble naked mole rat. I think uh, people have been a little disconnected with nature, you know, over the recent years, and I think it's time to kind of get back outside and uh, embrace the tree, <laughs> go hug a tree, and uh, just appreciate the animals that are out there and learn to, to love nature again and pass that along to your children and grandchildren. And uh, animals in the wild are really having a tough time in some areas of the world. They're becoming endangered and critically endangered in some areas, and it's just kind of a good place to learn about that, learn what you can do even in your own backyard if it's a recycling and taking care of things that we can take care of. That's making a big impact on the earth that we live on. You adopt the, the cockroach or the, the naked mole rat, uh, you get an adoption certificate, and then you get some artwork uh, from the actual mole rat or the actual um, cockroach. And so there's a little uh, artwork piece that you get, and then the picture as well. So we'll send a picture along um, of the cockroach or the naked mole rat, whichever one you adopt. Get a Valentine's Day. You know, the, the money raised from this goes to help uh, take care of the animals here at Scoville Zoo. And, and so we really appreciate people uh, embracing this idea and adopting our mole rats and cockroaches. Do not get me that yeah. for Valentine's Day. Let's get her that. <laughs> I have one back in the office. Oh, no. Don't tell her. Okay, I won't. If you want a Make unique Valentine's gift, you can call the Scoville Zoo for an application. Mm. They'll send you one of those cute little cards that you saw with the little pictures and the oh. little artwork. A little personalized piece of art made by a hissing cockroach or a naked mole rat. Did you see a little? Um, I did. A little like paw prints of the naked. It was kind of cute. Okay, oh, oh, it's like an ugly cute.